What's going on with the YouTube? It's your boy 345 German. In today's video, we're going to be giving y'all a video on how to properly shift using the paddle shifters. If y'all got the paddles in y'all car, we ain't going to be using a stick, but we're going to be using the paddles themselves, y'all. So make sure I stick to the end. We're going to be showing y'all what RPMs to upshift at and what RPMs to downshift at. And then, like, how to accumulate the fastest speed possible with it type shit. So make sure y'all boys stand to the end. But for the time being, we're gonna give y'all a cool little one flip for one TV. Let's try here this bitch for one TV, man. Woo! Never fails, man. That's all I see. But we're about to get up out of here. Let me give y'all a walk around of it. It is dirty because it was snowing, y'all. So chill on me in the comment section below. And I got hella bird boo boo. They just drenched me. I ain't gonna lie. But as y'all can see, though. We about to get up out of here and we about to show y'all how to get active with them paddles and how to properly shift, how to be fast as hell and all that. So, yep. Look at my racks, solid. I see the grass getting long. Snakes, I'm gonna mow it. I'm gonna blow like brown. Racks on me, I'm sorry. Talk here, talk in the morning. I'm in the car, got motion. Big man, roll, can't fall. Put on my seatbelt real quick for y'all boys. And then for today, we're gonna be driving it in street mode only. So I'm gonna take it off of Eco. We're gonna do it in street mode specifically. And then we're gonna show y'all how to upshift and downshift using these paddles, man. But I'm about to get out of here first and then I'm about to go to manual. So, but this for the people who've been wondering, like, yeah, I got paddles, but I only use them for my car to make them downshift loud and shit like that. But I don't really know how to use them and shit like that. Or if you just now getting paddles and you really want to know how to use them without damaging your trans or you don't want to miss a shift and stuff like that. So we're going to be showing y'all what you got to do to properly use them and all that. And we're going to get your boys right, man. But since we on the street real quick, as y'all can see, it's at 15 miles per hour and then automatic, they automatically shift it at the it automatically shift at 2500 rpms in automatic yard but when i'm doing it in manual i'm gonna upshift at like 4500 rpms or 3500 so that's either between the three and the four is when i'm gonna upshift so i can have a, a smooth shift without it uh damaging anything so that's what we're gonna do so we're gonna watch our rpms then upshift 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 Crack the one of our here too. So downshift at like 2500 to 1500 as well. So you upshift and downshift at 3500 to 4500 is like the latest I would say to try to go. And then downshift wise 2500 to 1500. So keep that in mind, y'all. And I might be wrong too, but I'm also a beginner. But this is based off the experience that I know personally from my car specifically. You know what I'm saying? So, if I'm wrong, correct me down in the comment section below. But downshift, go third, break, downshift. First gear. Upshift. Upshift. Downshift on a turn. It's a little hard trying to balance both paddles and then hold my camera, y'all. So if I'm looking like I'm driving weird, it's because I'm trying to catch the paddles and I make these turns at the same time. Chill on me, man. And as y'all can see, man, like I said, it's driving real smooth. Now I'm about to start going a little bit faster for y'all so y'all can see how it is. It's going to take a little bit more control for me right now because I do got one hand trying to do it for y'all. So. see that 
down shift. Down shift. Down shift. Your last one. Boom. You just successfully use the paddles, the fluent way type shit. You see how I didn't really sound like my car was getting damaged too much either. It sounded like there was fluent, like how it was supposed to. So you're gonna do. You hear my shit though. My shit sound crazy as fuck. In street mode, not even in a pat pat mode. Mm -hmm. It's not in pat pat mode, not in track mode, of course. Cruise into like a uh, say you going like 35, 40 ish. I say stay in gear three and four. No, four and five actually. Put less stress on your trans and shit, make it less hotter. And that's how you properly use your powder stickers up and down. Look, we put it back at automatic, and look what I said like gear five, gear four and five when y'all going like 30, 35 ish is what y'all want to use. That's what y'all cruising, like I said. Not one, two, and three to put less thrust on your trans. That's what you just use to accumulate more speed type shit, y'all. Well, third gear, third and second. So keep that in, keep that in mind, man, when y'all trying to use them paddles and y'all don't want to fuck up nothing, man. But we're going to end the video off here. And make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe. We are proud of here. Solid. I see the grass getting long. Snakes, I'm gon' mow it. I'm gon' blow like brown. Racks on me, I'm sorry. Talk here, top of the morning. I'm in the car, got motion. Bib ain't wrong, can't fall.